Well, if you're a pensionist worker, uh, uh, you work for a political boss. In the old days, they would say to you, you come and work with uh, this machine uh, elected official and we'll make sure that you have a job. And that happened across the spectrum in Chicago and, and in Cook County many years ago uh, because it was a way to perpetuate a system that kept people in power. And many times they weren't uh, tested and many of them had not got the necessary skills in order to run those offices that they ultimately placed them in. And they got those jobs simply because they were patronage workers. I have no problem with jobs because you want to see everybody who can get a job and work. We want them to work, but uh, we simply have to do something about this patronage system because it is a total detriment. There is no place in government, and I want to repeat that, there's no place in government for patronage workers. There's a place in government for people who want to come to work, do a job, and uh, do it well. That's what it's all about. The uh, Fortunate thing is when we organized the Hare Washington campaign, we were independents, and we organized the campaign based on integrity and character and trust. And much of that now has been jettisoned in government. You don't have people really talking about trust, talking about integrity and character. As a precinct worker, I mean, I've actually been shot at in the community because people did not want uh, the system changed. At the time, we were making a lot of noise and getting a lot of people involved in the process, and people were afraid that if we took over, everybody would lose their job. Our position is that if you run a government office, everybody who can't do their job should go. And you should try, if you possibly can, to help those people find employment elsewhere where they got the skills that are commensurate with the job that they are supposed to do. We don't know if they were patients workers or not. All we know is that they were, they were shooting. What I do know is that we were out campaigning one night along uh, Hamlin Boulevard and uh, Ferdinand. And as we campaigned, uh, some person heard us out there making noise and uh, he uh, told his wife to bring him his gun. And she brought the gun. and. Uh, so he commenced to start shooting at us from a second floor window. And of course, we tried to take cover behind trees and everything else we could hide from. But uh, he still got off the shots. Fortunately, no one uh, was, uh, was hurt. And then we had a young man, uh, Butch Campbell. Butch Campbell was working with us and, and somehow he ran into these guys who were uh, Patron his lovers, and they beat him up, knocked his eye out of the socket. And the Reverend Paul Jakes, the civil rights leader, Reverend Paul Jakes, but also got beat up because they just did not want to change the system. They didn't want to change what they were doing because what they're doing paid off for them. Uh, Hale came and he said, Patron is, is dead, and I'm stomping my feet on it. It is dead, it's in the ground, it's gone. And as a result of that, people did not have to work for a precinct organization anymore. Of course, some people want to want to be involved in politics, so they help anyway. Well, it's still bad. Uh, I classify the level of uh, patronage workers in Cook County uh, classified as being widespread. Because if you look at uh, many of the workers that that are in the Record of Deeds office and look at how they came uh, to that system, where they came from, you can see that patronage still exists. But uh, the ultimate goal here is to get rid of all the patronage, hire people because they got certain skills, give them a good job, pay them for it, and uh, once they have that job, they can, can appreciate it. I think after January 1st, we're looking very, very keen at uh, at uh, moving the system forward, uh, pressing on to pass out information, get the information out there that we are going to change the way the record of D's office works. Harold used to say that, I don't care where Patriot is, I'll find it and I'll stomp on it because it's all over. And 
that's the same way that I feel. Patronism has to go. There's no other way to put it. Patronism has to go.